The people are simply protesting to get their message out that the real terrorist is Netanyahu. And since we, many people talk about October, but no, everyone fails to mention 1948 and 1968, when Israel created an open air prison and prevented Gazans, Palestinians, from living or having just a decent life. And now they are starving the people. They are bombing schools and hospitals. And the people here are protesting to say that that's not right. And the United States should not be aiding and abetting a terrorist like Netanyahu. He is a terrorist. And his cabinet, who are calling for the starvation and the annihilation of the Palestinian people, it is a terrorist act on the part of Israel. Free free Palestine from rapists, terrorists, murderers, and kidnappers. Destroy Hamas. The Israeli consulate is merely responding to an atrocious attack from October 7th, and still a hundred hostages have been were kidnapped on that day are still held in Gaza or wherever they're holding them. And Israel wants every one of those people returned, and I completely agree. And until then, the war will continue. And they can call it a genocide, they can call it apartheid, they can call all the little names that raise the flags and raise everybody ires and the people that don't do any ask questions and look for real evidence and real the real story will accept that. Shut down the DNC! Shut down the DNC! Shut down the DNC! Shut down the DNC! Kill her Kamala! It's not easy on both sides, and if I could form a wholehearted opinion and pick a side, I honestly could tell you I can't, and I don't want to pick a side. I don't want to pick anybody's side. Um, it's just, again, depressing to see everybody fight each other, and um, that's really all I can say for my end. I, I can't really say who's right and who's wrong, because whenever that happens, it just gets worse, and that's the most depressing part. I can't pick a side. <laughs> Oh my God, I think that Palestine should be free. I don't even think the people who have, oh, I, don't even, I don't think that it's right at all. Palestine should be free. There should, there should be a ceasefire and it should have been one. Because that's their land, technically, they've been there longer than the people who've been there. That's the truth. The truth don't need no support and I'm not being anti-Semitic either. I'm not talking against the, the Jews, anything like that. Be fair to your neighbor, it's in the Bible. They go by the Bible, right? You're supposed to honor thy neighbor. Those are your neighbors. Is that right or is that correct or not? the truth.
Thank you. 